triggers keep on triggering them all I've had enough of this, oh Our timeline's getting worn out when we're going back and forth In today's tutorial, I'm gonna teach you how to do this. Subscribe and hit the bell to get notified for more amazing tutorials that are yet to come. At first, drag the main clip into the timeline like this. Now I am adjusting and trimming the video according to my need. Now here is the portion on which I want the ink effect to happen. Now here I am changing the speed of my video. This is optional, you can skip this. Well I think that the clip needs some more adjustment. Now here in this portion I am making the video as 16 ratio 9 full screen using the crop function. I suggest you to record or use a video with full screen as this effect works best on the full screen videos. Now drag the ink effect video on above the main clip like a PIP. I am trimming out the portion that I needed. A point to note, if you are confused on where to get the ink effect videos, then don't worry, I have assembled more than 20 plus royalty free ink videos for you. To download them, just simply use the link in the description. So now this is the main part. Go to the between portion of both the clips. Now double click on the PIP ink video and here in the transform section, adjust the orientation and the scale and the size of the ink video. Well you can use the default size if you want to, this step is pure optional. Now once the scaling is done. Here, go to this compositing section and then select a compositing that suits best for your video. For me, this will do the job. Now our effect is done. Further additions like minor adjustment to the clips or adding color grading to the clips can also be done to make your video look amazing. So guys, what are your thoughts on this video? Let me know in the comment section below. And if you think that this video is worthwhile, then hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that I can able to bring amazing videos like this for you. Till then, see you later.